Okay. You all are professional women. Y'all do y'all shit. Right? Okay. You meet a professional man. He makes three times as I'm telling you right now, if you give me that thing, what? Y'all gonna hate me. You give me that <laughs> Y'all gonna hate me, bro. Put your cash up in the comments. Y'all already know how I, how I do, bro. That's a good conversation. Put your cash up in the comments. Also, if you want to join a thousand dollar giveaway, all you gotta do is subscribe to the channel and go and follow me on Instagram. You will be in the giveaway. The giveaway will be going down August 22nd live on this channel. You don't want to miss it. Hey, let's get into the video, fam. Oh, today. Okay. Three times as much. How hard will it be for you to slow up what you're doing and support him if he is trying to marry you? If he asks me to help him, I'm going to help him. Well, um, and about accent when a woman doing her job. So when a woman doing her job, it's natural. So doing the right things to a man, that's, it's come natural, you know. Especially when you trying to marry, it's, it's so important because that's your, we want to value that's your first marriage. You want, you want the big way in. So. Uh I like that because she said, like she said, it, it should come natural. It, it shouldn't be nothing that, that's something that got to be in you. you. You know, it ain't nothing you got to force. You feel what I'm saying? I rock, I rock with that. All that, you treat him good. All that time you spent, yeah, you would spend quite a time and, 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 and work on his lifestyle. If you love him, if uh, you want to get married. So what's the, so the question was, if he doing what he- Why don't you answer the question? How about that? I'm the co-host. I ask questions around this motherfucker. This is not the Fire Rose show. The question is, Fire Rose, you meet me. I make three times more than you. I want you to stop doing Instagram skits and modeling. Keep your ass in the house, cook, clean, fuck, and shut up. Is you going to do it? Yeah, because I'm a chef. <laughs> Now, Instagram model, I can see. Like, if you marry, you shouldn't be on there posting pictures, getting money, but doing skits and things like that. If your woman have a passion, you can't, you can't really get her to stop a passion. Because when you got that passion in you and it's just driving you, bro. Like, it's really hard. You know, I wouldn't even want my woman to stop her passion. Now, if she was an Instagram model, I wouldn't marry her in the first place. But if she's like a comedian and do skits and things of that nature, I wouldn't recommend her slow down with that. I'll try to do what I can to support her. We can support each other. But, bro, when, you don't, when you're on this content game and, well, you know, when you got a passion for real with anything, bro, like, you can't make nobody stop that. You feel me? I have to leave the house. I'm a loner. I like being in the house. Okay. So that's where you fucked up at. Okay. Like, I love being in the house. I will take care of you, daddy. What, what, the, what, what do you want? What do you know how to cook, chef? Whatever I want to make. You whatever what? Whatever I want to make and whatever he told me to make. Okay, put it like his question. Look, if he told me to make something, I know his favorite dish. If he had a long day at work, I'm going to make sure that's ready hot. Okay, yeah, like in the so, microwave, okay, he microwave. comes home from a long day of work. It's Wednesday night. He just came home from a okay, long day. What would you make for him? Fresh. I would make him maybe a, mm, I don't want to make steak. I would make him a salmon. I would make him a salmon with asparagus. Fucking fish sticks. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. She look like she can cook, though. Females like that, especially in the hood. I know a lot of females in the hood where I'm, where I'm from that look just like her, and they can cook. I'm just saying. I'm telling you. I don't want no goddamn fish. You don't want no salmon? No, nah, we just wanted to hear one of your, one of your dishes. What did, your you fish your, what did you fish your What did you fish your man this morning? Who She's single. She doesn't have a man oh. right now. So she didn't have Antoine Williams, 1999 Super Chat. Hey. Antoine Williams, if you love to do all that, you would not be single. Stop the cat. Hey, Boogie's way too hard now. We gotta bring Antoine.
on the show. Jolly and running around the corner and have all them little fucking gift bags and whatever the fuck. Listen. (laughs) (laughs) I'm single. It's the fact that I have fucking priorities Uh and I choose what I want. I have things that people don't understand. Like, you don't even keep your word. You got a whole bitch and you want this fucking life. Small feller, $10 super chat. Girl. That's a good point, though, because a lot of females, single females, I swear, if you listen to them talk, you will swear that they the best woman on the planet. Then it, and then you think to yourself, like, okay, if she do all this, why she single? You know why? Because a lot of them be cap. You feel me? Does, it doesn't count. Back to the party. Hey, he what said he just because you made some grits and some hamburger helper don't make you a yeah. chef. Poison. That's what he said right now. Tuna helper. Oh, Tuna. Hamburger what? helper and grits doesn't what make you a chef. The chat is lit. Right? <laughs> hey, chat, listen. Right now, we are close to hitting our, our record. So what I need everybody to do, we only need 20 more likes to hit our record. I need everybody in the chat right now to hit that like button. Yeah. Facebook, oh, give me a shell. Instagram, give me a shell. Hit that like button. It's free of charge. Let's hit that 20, 20 extra likes and we're going to hit the record tonight. All right, Pretty Action. You got a beautiful company, casting, directing, producing, and things of that nature, right? So I'll meet you on set at one of these films, and you got on them yoga pants. Yeah. yeah. You know them yoga pants that kind of got like, it's all tight except for the booty part where let your booty just kind of just be free. And I see it. And I say, damn, I like that. So, you know, I start day, we start day, we go out, you know what I'm saying? We hang out a couple times. And I realize that I want to take it the long way with you. I really want to protect and provide at a high level. But, you know, I don't need you out here doing strip club scenes in these movies. Is you willing to slow down on your career for this marriage? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now, if you marry, honestly, you shouldn't be doing strip club scenes in movies. You should be like, no, nah, I'm married to have to respect. Honestly, if you marry, you shouldn't be kissing men in movies. I'm sorry. This is just me. There's a lot of actors out there that respect their marriage. Well, not a lot of them, but I've I, I seen a couple of them that... Like one of the guys I know, he's a very popular actor, but he won't kiss no women in his, in his movies because he respects his wife. I just think that's how it should be if you're an actor. I'm just sorry. That's me. I don't know about y'all. Y'all probably think different. <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> she took too fucking long. Aside, all jokes aside, if if marriage is the goal and I'm really, really feeling it, you know, two story type shit, you know, I let a nigga chase the bag and I hold him down, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you have to maintain your side to keep me there. So if you're in a situation, know that this ass is back in the street. Okay. okay. So I can sit down as long as you're worthy of me sitting down. Okay. So, so go fuck up if you perfect. want to, and I'm not sitting down no more. And then yeah. breaking my I ain't shit. I ain't Snatching my bundle. Uh huh. Put in your hair. Your knees gonna be ashy like them bows, but they give me the stash. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm- you know what? Honestly, I can't even be mad at their response because if you. Take a woman that's getting to a bag and you tell her to stop getting to the bag to support you. And now you're not getting to the bag. What else do you expect her to do? Her only instinct is to go and get back to the bag again because you took her from that. You feel what I'm saying? So, yeah, I, I really can't be mad at the response. If the roles were reversed, okay. would you do it for me? Okay. Would you uh, sit the phone down if I on. make it three uh, times the money? Stop slinging that dang line. Okay. That okay. mouth too. Excuse, excuse, yep. excuse, 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 Damn, excuse me. Damn, the mouth too. I got you. Hold on. <laughs> if Oprah Winfrey <laughs> no. wanted to marry me and she wanted to pay all my bills, I don't give a fuck. I will cook, clean, fuck, and shut up. Okay, see? Y'all got shit miscon-
Hey, he ain't lying. <laughs> hey, he is not lying, bro. Oprah Winfrey, like, hey, you know what? I'm going to take you and get you everything. I'm going to buy you everything. All you got to do is exactly what he just said. I'm with it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's hilarious. No, not, bro. I'm talking hypothetically, not for real, because I'm married. You know what I'm saying? I got to make sure I clarify that. Y'all know how women is. Hypothetically, it's just a, you know, I'm married. <laughs> of the day it's about these kids and the next generation yeah. so if, if 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 i'm with pretty lady and pretty lady got the financials together i need to be as supportive of her making these finances as humanly possible so if i'm over this bitch making forty thousand and she making 4.2 million i need to shut down this operation and go make sure that she make eight because she's in a position to do more for the next generation than I am. So how can I be an asset to her? Well, when she making four by herself, she'll be making eight with me by next year. That's what women should be learning how to do. But a lot of these girls won't sit there at that $40,000 a, a year job while this nigga's over here trying to build an empire and he end up fucking the secretary. Clear that I'm not selling my soul, so it has to be something that I'm ready for. It's something that really does bring me joy and happiness. Like, I don't give a fuck about that. <laughs> you got too many motherfucker credentials for me to pay your bill. Ah, fuck it, I'll just get another one. I'm the rich nigga, not you. You don't make the goddamn decision. <laughs> Just go find me another chick that's gonna go. You got too many prerequisites for me to upgrade your lifestyle. You got too many prerequisites for me to goddamn take care of your kids. That ain't mine. You got too many. You're making it too hard for me to upgrade your life. I don't want all these goddamn prerequisites and rules and shit. I'm paying the bills. You're stopping the bullshit that you're doing. Okay? Any questions, comments, or concerns, you can head back to the partner. Yeah, all that shit. Oh, if I do this and he has to do, I don't. I paid the motherfuckers. Shut it down. Being real, happy life only happy when wife. you got a happy wife. You got a big I mean, I'm a six-figure woman quiet. by myself, so he's making and three times my cook money. Clean. It seemed like it was about the fact that this man came with three times his money. Am I ready to stop so doing what I'm doing to yeah. make my six mm -hmm. figures? Exactly. Yeah. To let his fix, yeah. six figures hold down our right. lifestyle. Hell yeah. yeah. And yeah. I'm saying if he treating me right and I'm in love, because it ain't going to be the first time that I didn't came across a nigga with some money. Thank yeah. you. And I also make my own money. Thank yeah. you. And I could probably surpass you. So you got to be that nigga for me to put my shit on hold. It's all I'm saying. But that's that's a fact, though. Like, I, I don't advocate for a man telling a woman to stop, especially if she has a very successful career, telling her to stop what she doing to come and follow me. Nah, keep doing what you're doing, especially if you love doing what you're doing, unless it's something... But like I say, you shouldn't even be looking to marry a woman like this, like a woman in the entertainment industry doing OnlyFans or something like that. You shouldn't even be looking to 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 marry a woman like that. So I'm not even talking about them type of women. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about women, let's say a woman who went to school for how many years you take? 17, 14, whatever, how many years to be a doctor, dentist, all of these type women. So you can't expect for them to be like, hey, quit this. They, they sacrifice so much to become that. And say, quit this to come and follow me. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, uh, like, nah, I wouldn't even expect that of them. But now if they willingly say, hey, I want to come and support you and we can do this, build this empire together, that's cool. But I'm uh, that that's true. She said, if I'm a six figure and I'm, you know what I'm saying, gonna stop and support you, like you gotta be really that guy, which I'm pretty sure. Like, I mean, I to wholeheartedly agree with you. You gotta be that guy for sure. On fire, Rose. Your ass ain't making no sense. You gonna surpass what? You can't play that big bank, take little bank with everybody. Your shit is projected. My shit is reality. My shit parked outside. Your shit is still on your goddamn wish list, okay? We can talk about reality, and we can talk about potential. I'm potential to be a billionaire, but I'm a millionaire today, queen. It hit different. Fire, Rose. You still ain't making sense. Hush. I'm talking to pretty lady right now. Same question for you, Jess. Would you shut it down, Miss Jess? If you would you shut it down? Would you shut it down if you had a guy that's making three times as much as you? Would you shut down the trap and go help your man? 
Yes, because I think he'll help me. <laughs> so if I'm helping him, he's going to help me in the long run. Because I can just shut, clean and fuck, fucking shut up. We're going to go to the mall together. We're going to be happy. Ooh, okay. She got them legs out, boy. Sit up tall so they can see they your do. fine ass. Sit up tall. There you go. I want them to see. Oh! Anybody else want to stand up? <laughs> Diaz, let us know where the next topic is brought to us by. Uh, next topic is brought to us by Three Young Queens. Three Young Queens original uh, shea butter, body oil, sprays, all that good stuff. Three young ladies put their, their mind together, have their own company. Make sure you tap in with them. Three Young Queens on Instagram or... Y'all go tap in with three young kings on Instagram. Um, three young ladies. Y'all feel me? Hey, but hey, thank y'all uh, for watching the video. Y'all tell me what y'all think about the video in the comments. And if I should do more videos uh, from B, uh, Big VM, BVM, uh, Ugly Money Type. But hey, uh, thank you guys for watching the video. And see you guys next video. And always remember, be safe for the kings. Let's see.